Hello everybody. <clears throat> Welcome to my channel. This is Monique's Jewels and I have a kind of a special jewelry video for you today. It has um, kind of like the boxes that you buy from Shop Goodwill, the mystery boxes or um, American Thrift Supply, except with these, which will be bags, not boxes. With these boxes, bags, whatever you want to call them, this will be absolutely wearable jewelry. You will not have to fight through it. You will not get dirty. You will have all wearable jewelry. And I'm going to show you what I'm putting into each bag and they will be numbered. These will be 25 plus shipping. They will be all wearable, really nice jewelry. And in the intermission time, I think I have just a couple pieces of sterling that you guys haven't seen. I don't think you've seen my, I have a charm bracelet that's made that can be added to. I have some charms and I have a couple of bracelets here that are sterling. And we'll do that in the interim when I kind of switch over to something. So what I've got, I have a group, so I have a bag here. This bag here has all, all crystal jewelry, like shiny crystals. Um, some of these pieces are marked, some of them aren't. So this will be divided in two. I will show you all the pieces quickly. So I'm gonna go through that one. Now, this here is all marked jewelry. Like I said, the crystal jewelry, some of it's marked, some of it isn't, but it's all beautiful. These are all marked pieces in this bag. Let's see, I've got so many bags here, hold on. This is more or less organic stone and pearl jewelry in this bag, and I'll show it all to you. That will be by itself, so you're gonna get a ton of stuff. Okay, now this is unmarked jewelry. So I'll probably divide that into two for 20. Um, or whatever. Um, here we have, these are like earrings and pendants, which will be added in. So this is going to be fun, but I have to like really remember what I'm doing here because they're different things. Hold on, I'm sorry. Something's wrong. Then I have this group here has got some beautiful pieces also. That'll be one group. And like I said, this is unmarked, but very, very nice. So let's go ahead. Let's get a get a start on here. Um, this is my email address. Please register and subscribe to purchase for my next live, whenever that will be. It might be this week. It might not be till next week. Um... I'm still working on um, getting some more jewelry. I don't know if I'll do American Thrift again or not. I just was not very happy with it. Um, to register, just email me your full name, shipping address, and your PayPal email. Okay? That way, after you're subscribed and you register, you'll be able to purchase. Plus, you'll be able to enter the giveaways. Shipping cost is $5 or less overweight. Overweight would be about 11 ounces 12 ounces. It's going to go up from 5 to 6 and then up to 16 ounces to a pound. For a pound, it's going to be about $8. So just remember that because this will be plus shipping. Okay, and please be kind in the comments. All right, so I'll set that over to the side here. And if you wouldn't mind, a thumbs up would help out so much. You know, Facebook kind of runs on uh, algorithms, so the more thumbs up you get for a video, the better it is. I know a lot of people forget and just don't do it. But if you could, that would be wonderful. We're still looking for new subscribers. And we're trying to get to 1,000 here in the next couple months. We're at about almost 880. So we're getting there. Slowly but surely. Okay? Wonderful. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do, I think this is a bag of beautiful pieces. These are 25 plus shipping this bag right here and i'm just gonna just like show you what's in here we are not going to take a whole bunch of time for this 
This is sterling clasp, sunstone with crystals. This is beautiful. This is like halite because it's cold. Here are your razorback clam pearls. Just beautiful. Here's some more pieces here. So this will all be yours, okay? This is gorgeous. I wanted to wear this the other day and I didn't. It's kind of a light pink, kind of a ring pearl with those beautiful seed beads and it's a tiny magnet and it's so pretty on. Okay, then we have my favorites. That is amber. This is, it's not um, jasper, it's just Dalmatian stone, okay? They changed it. Beautiful. You've got a little bit of alpaca here. This is gorgeous. You've got the mother of pearl with wood, going along with the nature theme here. Some glass. Oh, that's so cute. That's alpaca. Look at that. Little sandals. This gorgeous hunk of agate. Isn't that pretty? Okay, so you kind of see what's in here. A little pearl and leather here. So this is all together. And what we're going to do, we're going to put it in a, we're going to bubble wrap it. But it's going to go into a bag. And I'm going to go ahead and just put these in a bag and mark this as number one. And these are 25 plus shipping. I don't think you could ever purchase this much jewelry as a mystery, kind of a mystery bag um, from these other places. Oops, get in there. This will be, this will be in bubble wrap. This will not come this ridiculously flimsy. Okay, this is number one. 25 plus shipping. The shipping might be seven or eight bucks. So that is number one. Wonderful. Those are some of my favorite pieces in there, guys. Okay. So number two, I think we'll do, we're going to put a few and a few together. These are unmarked. Some of, well, some of these are marked. I forgot about that. Yeah, some of these are marked. So let's go through these and make sure I've got the pairs. Pretty little guest ring, Harley Davidson. That is um, Premier Design. These are Monet. That's a Monet. This is, um, oh, what do you call it? 1926 Girl Scout pin. That is, um, of course, Avon. Just let me make sure I've got all the pairs. There's the other pair of the Harley Davidson. And let's make sure I've got that one there. And make sure I've got this one. It's kind of fun, really. You got this one. I think these are Monet's. They're marked. I just can't see it. And then we've got, there we go. And that's a Monet. So we've got this little group. And these are all unmarked. So I'm going to put a couple. So we'll do kind of like this. You've got these two bracelets. This is gorgeous. You've got this and some earrings that match. That was actually in the um, American Thrift Supply. I'll have to grab the earrings. This is really pretty. It got kind of tangly, but it's really nice. It's like multi-strand and it's just really pretty. I don't know what happened, but I'm not gonna take the time to untangle it. It's very simple to untangle. So there's another necklace. Here are the earrings that go with that. And this pretty. There's nothing wrong with any of this jewelry. There are no missing pieces. Nothing's broken. There's that. Let's pull out a couple of necklaces. We've got this pretty piece. Sorry. This is gorge. Love it. Not pretty. That one. 
this super long piece that is so pretty very unusual I'm very surprised it's not marked that piece and this iconic little kind of a resin bead gold with all the tans and that'll be enough for that and i'll put let's see oh, we got a, oh i got a couple of brooches i'll add to this pile let's see here brooch brooch and let's see now yeah. these are not marked here's a little ring very very good condition and then this pretty ring okay so that's a little lot right there I'll put it in a bag and like i said these will be bubble wrapped and stuff make sure and i'll make sure all of the pins are shut and put all of these this will be number two see how that came open let's shut that real quick while we're talking well we had a really good weekend I mowed, cooked, did dishes, the baby and his mother, Chanel and King, are at a birthday party for two of his cousins that have birthdays back to back. And they are swimming and having a pool party. So this is number two, 25 plus shipping. All right. Number three. Oh, these are all very... These are, this is the crystal lot. So I'm gonna take half of these out. Uh, we have, oh my goodness, we have some beautiful pieces in here. We have J. Crew. we have some other stuff. Let's see, I'll leave this for another bag. Okay, make sure. And what I'll do is make sure we got the, the pairs to the earrings. Okay. So we have the Lucite Ball. This is laying bright. No, what is this? This is Loft with the little crystal. Beautiful. This is J. Crew the Lucite Balls. Just about as cool as you can get. This is a beautiful stretchy. This is a gorgeous. Look at this. This is a pendant to go on a chain. But I just thought it was so pretty and it's got the crystals. We got that. We've got this, this is Carol Lee. Beautiful faux pearls and oh, we've got this. This is so cool. This is probably worth $25. This is a lead crystal antique necklace oh my god it's so pretty okay there's that then we have these this is beautiful look at the shine on those beads okay there's that Let's see here now like i said i'll make sure i've got the pairs look at that isn't that pretty got that earring i'll find the other one here hold on down in here somewhere. Let me get it. Yeah, I just thought this would be so nice to get some jewelry out to people. Um, I'm getting kind of fed up with the trash that I've been getting. Um, so I thought this would be nice. A nice way to share jewelry. we got tangles. Got a huge tangle here. Okay. Well, two. Is it in here? There it is. I'm hunting for something that's already there. Okay. So then you have the crystal here with the heart. You have the crystal here. And I'll make sure I've got the pairs for those. I probably have to grab them. Sorry, I keep hitting the camera, but I can't help it. I'm trying to get. Oh, this is pretty. Look at that. We got that one. This is another J. Crew, if I remember. No, it's not. Huh. Well, anyway, it's gorgeous. 
look at that. So there's that one. Here is a pretty little piece here. A little crackle glass. Let's move these so I can find their pairs. This one I'm still looking for. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is like a Y necklace. This should have been marked. I don't know. It's just so pretty. Very light. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Okay, I'm not doing sizes and all that stuff because this is more or less a mystery bag, but I just want to show you what's going on in each, each one. And more crystals. Kind of a triple strand rosary style with glass crystals that are just beautiful. Okay, let's find these earrings. Okay, they're right here. Okay. So we have the crystal hearts right here. We have these. These are very pretty. And this one is right here and these are also gorgeous so that right there is number three I'll put it in a bag and like I said these will be in bubble wrap and it should be very fun to, to receive and get and get a lot of jewelry for very little and you know it's all wearable it's all nice and that's what I'm looking for. Okay, number three. See, when I'm reaching over, I have to reach over this camera stand. That is number three. Okay, we'll start on number four. We have kind of unmarked pieces here that are so cute. I paired these two together because they look exactly identical, the stone. So that starts off this bundle, number four. There's that. Set that there. Then, oh, these little ones like this, I will make sure I put these in little bags so they will not get all tangled like they are right now. Then you have the silver with the heart. And these are all in fabulous shape, guys. The gold balls, oh, that is so iconic. That is beautiful. And gold tone is fabulous. Fabulous. All you need is some little gold balls for your ears. Little gold ball. Um, gold ball beads. This is Avon. That's sweet. There's that. And there's this one. And I'm not counting the pieces because that's not what this is about. This is just kind of pairing things together. And you guys can kind of pick and choose if you want one or not. This is the heart. The beautiful little Singapore gold tone. This one here. Doesn't have a maker, but it's kind of... This is just beautiful. This will go with anything. We have kind of a copper. Then we have a gold. Then we have silver. And then copper and gold. Gorgeous. So that's that. Then we have this very interesting piece here with the mesh snake chain. Gorgeous piece. The, all these pieces, like I said, are just in the most fabulous shape. Kind of a gold and silver tone basket weave. And look at this one. Now that is so pretty. In excellent condition. Looks like it's never been worn. And then, let's see. What I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add some of this bag okay so you have some really pretty earrings here jnc we have another avon ring there might be a little wear on it but it's still cool then we have the wings and they are marked and you know i never it's like marcy marcy mercy marcy wings breast cancer awareness pin LC, Liz Claiborne Kitties, or Panther. This is a Chico's. Really cute. This is a, another really nice. It says PG, or PD, Premier Design maybe. Isn't that pretty? I like that. So you've got the dark crystal and the light crystals. And it does 
really not have much wear. You can tell somebody wore it a little bit, but wow, it is so pretty. And then we have this Maui 95. Very cool. Monet. These are beautiful. You have a beautiful little 1976 brooch with the double flags. How cool is that? Then I do believe, you know, I'm not sure about this pen. Let me look at it. Let me see if I can find it. 120th 10K gold filled. This I do believe is a Masonic lapel pen. Very, very interesting. And this is a beauty. Look at that. And it is marked, I think it's a Monet. Hold on here. Nope, it's Avon. How cute. Very nice. Okay, we've got... These are marked pieces. We're going through these like crazy. Wonderful. Okay, I'm going to put a couple more necklaces in here. We got this beauty. This is gorgeous. Mother of Pearl. Beautiful gold tone. Kind of a light Figaro. Looks brand spanking new. Then we've got this double chain. Isn't that pretty? Brand new looking. Then we've got these little heart earrings. They're so sweet. Those are cool. Put those in there. Let's see what else have we got. Get another necklace. Oh, this is a necklace set. There's two, there's actually two necklaces and a pair of earrings. You see those? Look at that pretty green. And the necklace is just the same as the, as the earrings. I can get it. Yeah, there it is. Okay. So there's that. These are in perfect shape. Looks brand new. That's why it's in that little bag so they didn't get all tangled. And I think I'll put in a couple more pair of earrings. There's one. And there's two down here. Here's one. These are gorgeous. Aren't those pretty? Put these in. And then, oh wow, I love this. Look at that. Beautiful gold tone, that'll go in there too. And, let's see. We are getting through these guys. Let me put a couple more braces in here. Got a gold thing going on. This is that gorgeous bracelet. I don't know if you guys remember this. With the cabochons on the edge, fold over clasp. It can be shortened or lengthened. We'll put that on top. And we've got this. This is, I don't know if you guys can see, it's leather and real pretty color. This is a fossil. It says issue on, oh, 1954. I don't know quite what that means, but this is gorgeous. Okay. And what else can we do here? Let's see. Okay, these are all marked pieces. So let me get a couple of these out. Okay, so I'll add this to that group. Just beautiful. This is a Leah Sophia and it looks just like a Leah Sophia. So we have this Leah Sophia that I'll put on top of this pile. And then we have this beauty. It has a tassel. And like I said, I'll go back through and make sure that all of these little dainty ones are put into a bag, a little bag, so that they won't be all tangled like this one. You're always going to have tangles whenever you've got a big group of jewelry together. Okay. 
Well, I'm gonna have to use something to get that off of there. But this is 1946 and I will fix that. It's just caught up. It's just caught up in this little ring right here. Okay. Oh, I think I'm gonna be able to get it right now. There we go, sorry. <laughs> so there we go. This is so pretty. And it's got a long, long tassel, it's so cute. Okay, there's that group there. I think that's a good group. And we will put this at number four. And before I ship these out, I will probably individually bag a lot of these and put, um, this is a great group here, and put um, these light pieces in individual bags. I'll probably bag up all the earrings and pendants together. And these right here. Let me do this real quick. And there. And I'm going to put these in a bag. And I have smaller bags so I can put these in. So this will be number four. That is number four. And then we're gonna go on to number five. We're gonna start out with these crystal pieces. Oh, these are so pretty. And I'll probably divide these up before I put them in a big bag. That way they won't get so tangled. Okay. This is one of the prettiest necklaces I've ever had. And it just goes over the head. But these cr glass crystals, look at them. So we've got that one there. We've got this one here. That is 1946. Look at that. Okay, we got that one. That's number two. You guys can't really see them. Let me pull them over here. That's number two. One and two. Beautiful. Number three is a J. Crew. And it is like prong set crystals, Rivoli crystals. This thing is probably worth 25 by itself, maybe more. There's number three. Okay, we have this gorgeous little tie tack. Isn't that pretty? And we have, oh, this is so pretty. This is also J. Crew. That gorgeous I don't know can't get prettier than that that lime green that light mint green and look at the crystals on this baby all of them are there so that's that one then we have Graziano clip-ons with that micro mosaic beadwork look at that these are probably worth 20 bucks. <laughs> Gorgeous, that'll go in with that group. We have two very nice stretchies. Maybe, there we go. These are pretty. Very nice stretch. These are gorgeous. Look at that. We got that pair there, so pretty. The lemon yellow. Then we have this beauty. Oh, sorry. Very pretty. I like this one. We have that. And remember, guys, these are wearable. There is n no one has, you know, like no one's going to go back through and mess up stuff for you. Make It's not dirty. These are just two little um, doodads that are crystals. That kind of matches that necklace. There's that. The pineapple came off of another necklace. It's just too cute. Okay, then we've got, we're gonna finish off, I think with this bag, we'll put these together. Okay, 
Okay, we have these little heart earrings. Right here. And the reason why I'm doing this is because even though people like the mystery of it, I can't sell you things that you don't know, you know. I want this to be a better sale to you guys than just blindly buying what someone is, what a corporation is saying is a $50 bag of jewelry and it's just not worth anything. Those are cute. Wow. Then we have these resin tortoise shell. Look at that. Those cute. Then we have the green. Almost like camo. Just too cute. So we're mixing kind of a fancy with a retro. Then we have the little Izod alligator. Put that on your purse. Then we have, these are pretty. These are really pretty. Now if I can find the other one, where'd it go? There it is. Very pretty. Have those two to add. Oh, these are gorgeous. These little infinity ring with the crystals. We'll add that. You guys, this is Avon. This is so cool. This is crushed coral and turquoise in this beautiful little. I think this is probably stainless, but it's on a very. These are older. These are eighties. Very nice chain, very long, probably 22 inches. Got that. We've got this cute little bracelet with turquoise and hearts. This is a beautiful pendant, but it's an enhancer and it will go over the top of beads. Or you can wear it with a chain. Gorgeous. Look at that blue. Beautiful blue. Then you, oh, this is cute little resin agate cute as a button that's an older piece and then we have this beauty resin with the stones in it it's so sweet okay next we have these little earrings and I think I dropped the other one yeah I did hold on it went flying cute Oh, these are so sweet. Little summery earrings. Summer. Summer is almost over and I'm so sad. Okay, next. That goes with this group is these lion earrings. Do lion door knockers. They are so neat. They are not marked, but they should be. They're so cool. Okay, those go in that grouping. Then you have a beautiful ring pearl. Very nice. Not sterling, but just in great shape. Very pretty. Then you, oh, this is cute. Speaking of summer is leaving us. Snowflake pendant. And then you have, and then we're back to the summer again. You have this beautiful shell. This is very reminiscent of a, either an Avon or a Monet. I don't think it's marked. Okay, so there, that is a group that has some very nice pieces. I'm going to add in these little earrings. Aren't these cute? Wow. Brand new. Really cute. So I'm going to put these in, but I'm going to divide these up already. I don't want everything messed up. Um, that is a very dainty piece. These are not. So I will put the more solid pieces in here and then we'll put them in a big bag here in just a few minutes give me just a minute that won't that's fine put those in here and grab some mono. and then these won't get hurt these are the ones i'm worried about That one. Put those earrings in there. Okay. Fold this up. This is actually number five. And look, it's already marked number five. That's funny. It's number five. Remember, guys, these are 25 
plus shipping. You're going to get a huge group of jewelry that is very pretty. You don't have to worry that they're dirty or crappy or ain't, <laughs> ain't worth a hoot, which is some of mine were last time. Very upsetting. I'm going to put these two J. Crews together. And then these little dainty ones I'm going to put together. Okay. And I won't take anything out. And once they go in this bag, they're going to stay. Let's see. Let me get a nice little smaller bag. There's that. And we'll do an intermission here in just a second. I'll show you some of the um, sterling that I have. It won't be in a big bag, but you know, that can go in there. But these are very tang, you know, necklaces that will tangle very easily. So I'll put these in here so they can just kind of sit by themselves. And then, isn't that funny how that looks so close? As far as that crystal goes. And that's some. I'll put that in there. Like I said, I'll probably separate these out and put them back in this bag. So that bag isn't super heavy, but it's got some really, really nice pieces in it. And this is number five. Okay. And number six. These are all marked pieces, so I'm going to di just divide these right now into two. Just kind of go over here. And get one here. Divide these up. Put that over there. So we'll start with this bag here. This group here. Okay, in this group you've got a couple of Premier Designs. I know this one is. Very pretty. And it's not tangled. It's, it's double-stranded. Premier Design. This is Premier Design. Beautiful glass. Look at this. Look at that. This is also Premier Design with the leather. Looks kind of bright and esque. This is a very interesting piece. The gold tone and the leather. This is Fossil. I do believe. Is it? Yes, it is. It is Fossil. We got a fossil. This is gorgeous. Cookie Lee. Look how pretty this is, guys. Wow. Okay, there's Cookie Lee. And I think I'm going to put these two clampers. They're gorgeous. Cream and gold. Magnetized. Not marked, but just gorgeous. Those two we're going to put... I'll put some brooches in. I think you can just see them as I'm doing this. A couple rings. Look at that. Isn't that cool? A ring. Oh, look at that brooch. It's a frog. This is a pretty ring. It's a stretchy ring, but it's very nice. Stretchy ring. There's this. That earring is so cute. Let's find the other one real quick. Where are you? There you are. So we have the gold and silver together, which I love because I can wear stuff like this, even though I've got sterling on or a sterling necklace. Oh, that's pretty. I'll add that one. This is, I've actually worn this. Got a lot of compliments. It's rose gold and the stone is a pinkish purple. Not sure the size, but we're not gonna go into that. I'll add this one. That is so cute. These are like brand new guys. Okay, so we got that. I think I'm gonna leave this for the next group over here. Let me dump these out. Okay. So Let's put some more earrings over here. 
Isn't that pretty? Off white and black with the gold tone. Just gorgeous. Where's the other one? Sorry, here. There's that one. So pretty. All right, we've got that group there. Let me see if I've got a couple necklaces. I do believe I do. That I can add in to the bunch. Remember, most of these, these necklaces are marked. So I'm going to put this gorgeous seed bead, lovely piece, in with that group. And then we've got another gorgeous clamper. Isn't that pretty? Okay, so we got a nice big pile there. Let's see if I can do some earrings. Earrings are those sweet. Got those earrings. Ooh, these are cool. Now these are clip-ons. I'm gonna add them to the mix because they're so neat. Ta -da. Look at those. Those are beautiful. I don't think they're marked either, but they're awfully pretty. Look, nope. That really pretty frosted gold tone. So I'm gonna put those there. Let me see if I got anything else that'll match very well. I think that's pretty good. And I'm going to put these little beauties. Aren't those cute? Brand new on the card. Okay, so that is going to be group number five. And I'm going to kind of spread some of this. Put some of the earrings in here so we don't have quite such tangles. So this is number six. If I put the small ones in over here, kind of separate it from those, and we can do the, the um, bigger pieces all together. Let's put all these together. And this, oh, this is one of my favorite pieces. Look at that beauty. Look at her little eyelashes. Just gorgeous. That looks like a piece from the late 60s, early 70s. Might be a little bit younger than that, but very close. Very pretty. Okay, so we've got all those together. And then we'll put the necklaces all in one spot. Put these all in. Premier Design, one of my favorites. Cookie Lee, another one of my favorites. We'll put this beauty over here. And I will invoice these tonight and tomorrow, depending on how much time I have left. Let's see, let's put these in a separate one. Let's put this pretty piece. Let's get it right. Come here. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay, there we go. Put that in here. We're at 43 minutes, and you know what? I'm getting down to the bottom. Isn't that nice? Okay, so all of these will go in this bag. And that way, I can just put that in three bubble bags. And ship it out in this bag, and we'll be good to go. Sorry, I'm doing so much moving around. I'm hitting the cord. And I'll show you me putting them in there. And I think what I'm doing, I've got my phone plugged in. And I'm hitting that cord. So we're putting all this in. Okay. So we'll fold that over and put the number six. This one, like I said, you will have a big group of beautiful jewelry, and all of it's going to be able to be worn immediately. None of it's real dirty or anything, there's no missing pieces. Okay, so here we go. This is gorgeous, guys. This is Talbot's silver and gold, which you can wear with anything. I could put that on and it would match everything I've got. See, 
Isn't that pretty? So we've got Talbots. This is such a beautiful strand. These are beautiful. These are hand knotted. These are not real. But these are absolutely beautiful. Most of the time, if you see any wear, it's going to be down here because it clinks and clanks like on your table or desk or whatever. But yes, this is absolutely gorgeous. Okay, so we got Talbots. We've got this piece. We got this beauty. This is marked also. Oh, it's just marked China. But it is so pretty with the hammered and the circles. Very iconic. Beautiful. We've got that one. Then we've got Sarah Coventry. And um, Romel R&R, &R, he was talking about these little spots there. Even though they're pretty, you could wear it just like this. Or, back in the day, craftsmen would glue actual real stones, like little stones, some are precious stones there. But this is so cute. So this is Sarah Coventry. Then we have this gorgeous piece here. Kind of that funny electric cut. And this is made in Hong Kong, I think, if I remember right. Let's see. Yep. So you know that's old. You know that's old. So there's that. Then we have this cute little clown. No maker mark on that. We have a ring. pretty. Then we have, I think this, yes, then we have this little ring set. This is all costume, but cute. We got those rings. This is pretty. Looks like a little, um, smoky quartz, probably. Prong set, older piece. Then we have this is really pretty. You can find this on the internet for sale. A daisy, a Shasta daisy, probably. Then we have this. This is, what is this? This is Avon. And it is absolutely gorgeous. And it is still in perfect shape. You have all the crystals, all the pearls, faux pearls. All the pearl beads. Too cute. That'll go in that. Okay. Now this is Sugar Fix. And it's cute. Sugar Fix. Right there. Isn't that pretty? Very, very nice. Sugar Fix. And then we have this brooch. I love this. This brooch is so cool. That could fit on a skirt. That could fit on a blazer. A, a little felt hat. These were very popular back in the day. But this one's neat. Okay. Crystals on that one. Then we have the shell earrings. And they are not marked, but they're cool as can be. Pierced. Then we have this cutie. And it is a lucky brand. So you have this pretty part coming down. And then you have this at the bottom, hammered, gorgeous, kind of geometrical. Okay, then we have some stick pins, maple leaf, very, very cute. Then we have some more little, tiny little um, stud earrings. Here are some butterflies, and these are older. These are gorgeous. I should have kept these, but I'm not going to. Look at the crystals, if nothing else. These are very, very nice, and they are clip-ons. And just because you have pierced ears doesn't mean you cannot wear clip-ons. This is an all-knowing eye. I think it's hematite. That's what it looks like and feels. Isn't that cool? Then we have this beauty. 
just a little Isn't that pretty we've got that ring we've got a pretty little amethyst bead probably sterling I'm not real sure very cute Oh, amethyst bead. Then we have these cuties. I just saw the other one. Yeah, somewhere. There it is. We have these. Older piece. Then we have this little costume. Light blue. Stone and crystals. I have this little, um, looks like a little tiara ring very cute then we have these older screw backs these are so cute in fabulous shape they're probably from the 60s 70s then we have these pretty the dragonflies those are so cute especially for now for the summer i've seen so many this year and butterflies i've seen a lot more butterflies which is a good sign Scribble pen. I don't think this one is marked. Nope, but cute. It's a smaller one, so it's kind of neat. Then we have, yay, we have the bear. Okay, so this right here, I'm going to put in a few pieces that are left. And they're all super nice. They're all nice. This is like the leather court. I don't know. That might be leather from the smell. And look at that. So I'll add that one. It's very pretty. Then we'll add these two. Oh, yeah, these are cool. Cuffs. That one opens. So we've got these two. And then we've got some very modern modernistic looking earrings that I think are very neat we've got one, two. Oh, we've got a bunch of here. so the first pair will be the sunflowers beautiful let's see Where's the other one? there it is these just hang in your ear kind of a neutral color but very sweet then we have the white, which will go with absolutely everything. And those are just kind of an add-on. We have these, these are neat. And with these, we also have, let's see, these beauties. I love these. Modern, very pretty. Okay, and I'm gonna go ahead and add the Monet. These are Monet's. Pierced. And then I'm gonna put these in. I do believe. And we'll just put these in for good measure because they're cute. Okay, so we have that whole pile there of beauties. And I'm gonna put the earrings into a bag and then I'll probably add the rings to them just for until I need to um, bag them up if someone purchases we won't have a big mess and then we'll put the rings in some more of these beautiful earrings scribble the rings. So what else? Yeah, those were like the first. And there's this. That that is just so sweet. And there's that. And these two. Okay. Now this is going to be number seven. Don't pay attention to that number. That is not the number I need for you to pay attention to. Okay, these will go in this bag with the rest of this. <clears throat> go in here. That'll go over there. Yeah. And 
these will go in here. Like I said, I'm sorry that I'm having to hit that, but you know what? I can't help it. Okay, those two kind of just come together. There's that. So we will put these in a bag and mark it number seven. And if you purchase, email me please and let me know which number that you want. And I will absolutely scale it and see how much it's gonna weigh and let you know the shipping cost right away. And like I said, if it's up to a pound, it's gonna be about seven to eight dollars. None of these should be over that amount. I do not think. Okay, this is number seven. Fifty-six, and we're just about done. Okay, we do have another grouping, but that can go later on. This is what I kind of wanted to show you guys, and I don't know if you remember, I had made. A beautiful it's it's like a starter um, I think I don't think that's is that it backwards no that's an I don't know what that I thought that was a three I think that's an E maybe but anyway this is the one I made and it's got the little fairy these are all sterling the um, like the justice cheerleader we've got a frog Eiffel Tower, and this is all that you can build on this one. You've got the sun and the moon, I mean the moon and the star. You've got a Bible. These can be taken off, put back, you know, others added to it. Cactus. And I just thought that was Hamburg, Germany. I thought it was very interesting. Look at the smiley face. Now, if that's not cute, Oh, the beautiful horse with the horseshoe. Oh, wow. I forgot about that. Look at that. Indian head nickel. And we're back. Okay. So this one right here is $50. It is a starter. And like I said, you could keep the ones on you like. Take some of them off. But this one right here is 50, and I'll give you a measurement on this real quick. I don't think you could get one like this for under 100. Not now. Not nowadays. Okay, so I'll do a measurement on this real quick. Oops, come on, that's the wrong side. Okay, it is about seven and a quarter. All right, it's seven. It is seven inches, and you can always get an extender put on these very easily. You just go and have your jeweler put a couple more links on there. Okay, so we have that one there. It's so cute. And I, if I didn't have like six of them myself, I would just keep it, but it doesn't make any sense because I can't wear them all the time. Very pretty. So there's that. Then we have individual charms here. These are all gonna be 10. So we have Bambi, cute little Bambi. These are all marked. I think every last one of them are, are marked. Not real sure what they mean. So we have Bambi for 10. Now this Jostens, senior 70. I think back in the day, Jostens was doing Sterling, but I'm not sure. But this is for someone that graduated in 1970. That's very cool. So we will put five on that one because I don't think it's sterling. Now we have another gorgeous cheerleader. Isn't that pretty? That is Bo Sterling. She is 10. We have this gorgeous piece. It's just pretty. It's got like a little garnet and it's university. Let's see. University of, what is it? 
Yeah, you can read it. State College. In the back is Sterling. Ten. Then we have a very, very nice piece here. Look at this. Disney. This is Winnie the Pooh with his little honey pot. He is going to be 20. Look at that baby. It is so stinking cute. So we got the honey pot and he can be cleaned up a little bit. I wouldn't do too much. I, I would maybe wipe him a little bit with a Q-tip or um, cloth, but otherwise no. And then we're gonna put, let's see. Not pretty. Look at that little adventuring it looks like. Sorry, my hands are really dry because I was doing dishes and stuff outside. Isn't that pretty? I think it's marked. Hold on, let me look. SLV925 India. So, this beautiful little cross will put $10. I just love it. It's so pretty. You can just add on to to these bracelets. Let's see if I can get you to see it. It's very simple to get the ring. And um, what's good is to have somebody actually solder the rings on, but then you have to cut the rings off. So if you don't have them solder them, you can move them around and change them up. So that is ten. Then we have this cute little um, western hat. Isn't that sweet? I don't know if that says anything. I don't think it does. Hold on here. No, I can't read it. But does the hat have a mark? Mm -mm. So I'm not sure if that's Peter or Sterling. Not real positive. So let's put five on the hat. And then we have this cutie. And she's all ready to go. You just need to put a ring. You, you can wear this as a little pendant. She is a cheering away. And this is marked 925. And it's got a maker mark, but I'm not sure what it is. But it's beautiful. A little hammered piece. A little electric cuts. So we'll do 10 on her. This is the number 2. J S J C nine two five. So you have a number two, and that'll be ten. And then we have just something that's probably stainless. It's a unicorn. We'll put five on that. We have this little pearl that could be put on a charm. Beautiful little green colored pearl. It's real. We'll put five on the pearl. Then we have another gorgeous, look at this, Winnie the Pooh, he is too cute, and it is Disney. Disney Sterling, and he is 20, and he could be worn on a pendant also. And then I have this cutie. That would be a starter, and you could take the hearts off. It's like a starter bracelet. There we go. Isn't that nice? It's a very nice one. Spring ring clasp, and look at the end. The end is really well finished. It's very nice. So I'll give you a measure on this one, the starter. Pull out here. starter bracelet that has it is marked let's see here 925 Italy turn over it is right at 7 inches just a little under 7 maybe 6 and 3 quarters so it's not real big so you can have links added to this one, and we're gonna put, mm, let's put 20 on this one, okay?
okay? So, I have very little jewelry left. We have seven bags. They're $25 each plus shipping. I hope you've enjoyed my video. I will get back with you and everybody knows that I will email everyone that I have an email address for and we will see how everybody's doing and come this Thursday if I have any more jewelry left that I can show you that it would still be interesting. We will do a live. If not, we will we'll work on it and I'll have another video or two before week after next. Week after next, I will have some jewelry somehow, some way. So, you guys have a wonderful evening. I'm going to get off of here. And I must say that I think maybe my internet is finally fixed. And I think we'll do fine during the lives. And um, it took a little talking to them and trying to get them to understand what was going on. And they finally fixed it and gave me an up speed with a credit and a lower price per month. So it does work sometimes to talk to them and see what's really going on. Okay. Well, I'm going to get off of here. You guys stay well and stay blessed. And thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Give me a great big thumbs up. And if you haven't registered, all you have to do is email me at moniquesjewels2 at gmail.com. Get registered and we will have a big old giveaway during my next live. All right, guys. Talk to you soon.